Hello everybody. This is going to be a quick video. It's going to be a loner video on how to remove the hologram or holographic sheeting or plating or coating that's on a CD. This one's already started. Let me grab another one. And you know what? Yeah, I can just grab. I'm not sure if this one will work. But I'm pretty sure this one will. So there's a difference. Uh, it seems like some, the ones with data, and then the ones with movies, there's a big difference in them. Let's see. Just gonna grab anything, anything. <laughs> okay, here we go. Just to scrape, scratch. You have to scratch into your CD just to get it going. One good scratch. Let me get you guys closer. Okay, one good scratch. Have some kind of duct tape. I'm not sure if any other duct tape will work. And the reason I'm putting this video up as a loner is because my next project has to do with CDs. So I wanted to share with you guys how to get your CDs ready before I start the next project. Just in case you want to join me. So you just do that. And then you relift. You see? And that's how you get them started and you continue all the way around. And I love this stuff. If, if I can possibly keep some of it, I do. You can actually reuse this piece of tape onto your mixed media. So if you want, keep it around. Try to cover as much of the tape as you possibly can by, re by using it up. This video is not about that, is it? Anyways, so that's how to do those. And then how to do the other ones. I already cut it up. Let's see if this one will work. Because if it doesn't, then I can share with you guys how to do the other ones that don't work. I think this one will not work. Let's see. But we can still use it, that's what I want to say. Let's see. I think this has a movie on it or something. Yeah, see that's not going to work. No matter if I go into it deep or if I break into the seal, it still won't work. I've tried it. So what I like to do with these is go ahead and cut whatever design and since the next video I'm doing is feathers I'm going to cut a feather freeform feather And then usually it's really tight and you can't get in there and what you have to do is find something sharp my um, my nails don't work as far as going through with the with my nails usually I have my sharper tweezers but I don't have them with me right now oh and another thing that loosens them up this one seems quite loose but another thing that loosens them up is if you get yourself some pliers get a hold of it and go back and forth like this, wiggle it, and it starts to come apart. And you get your sharp object and you run it in between and they come apart. Some are easier than others. This one was very easy. So you can use this and you can use this one and that's pretty cool. It'll catch the light really nice. And then I'll show you what to do with all of this in the next video. So that's it for right now until the next video where I show you how to paint them up. Okay? And we'll be boop. That's all I'm going to show you. Painting them up like that. And I'll see you in a little bit. And if you'd like to fund this channel and fund me and help me out with my family, uh, the fund button will be right there. Just click it 
send me a dollar. I would appreciate it, and I'll talk to you guys later.